Hello guys and welcome back to Get Set Python. Now I have been getting a lot of requests from the users that the WhatsApp post updated is not working. So this video right here is having some issues because the class names have been changed by the WhatsApp. So in this video we'll see how we can correct those class names and make it working again. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So this is this the old code that I have been using in this video and let's see what the error is so first I'll try to run it and we will inspect what the errors are and then we'll try to solve them one by one so first of all we have to scan the QR code and Then we have to enter the name of our group or the user and our messages and let's set the count to 3 and once you can see that the QR code is scanned completely we have to press enter and it will try to send some messages but you can see that we've got an error which says that unable to locate this element with selector underscore 2s1vp which is this one so the message box is not enabled so we'll right click here and select inspect now you can use this tool and hover over here to get the element and you can see that this is the class name underscore 3u328 so this has been changed by WhatsApp. So what we'll do is we'll copy it and update it here. Now, I also believe that this button would have also been changed. So let's see that. So this is the button which is used to send the message and we'll hover it here. And in it, you can see that we have a button with class name underscore 3m hyphen n hyphen so we'll copy it and also update it here now let's try to run the script again and we have to repeat the procedure that is to scan the QR code enter the messages so we'll see check one two three and let's set the count to three and once the QR code is completely scanned we'll press enter and let's see here check one two three so you can see that by just changing these two classes we got the error removed so this is how you can send messages using this WhatsApp script by doing the automation so I hope all your errors are cleared. Now some of the users are also getting error in this web driver. So to solve that all you have to do is go to Google here and search for Chrome driver for your system which could be Windows, Mac or Linux. So once you do that you have to download it and check the installation procedure on Stack Overflow and you would be good to go. Now. Also, I've got a request that you want me to show a video in which we can send attachments using this WhatsApp script. So I'll try to cover it in the next video. This is for this video now. See you in the next video. Till then, stay tuned. Bye bye and have fun with Python.